How's it going guys? It's your boy Tunerator here. Today we are back with another YouTube video and I know there's a lot of tier lists being made lately and I also want to apologize real quick if you can hear background noise. That's not my intention but you know it's whatever. At the end of the day you can help it. So anyways guys today's video obviously is going to be about the Dragon Ball tier list as you can see from the title of the video. I saw a lot of tier list but none to this scale as far as Dragon Ball characters in general go. So this is encompassing all of OG Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT, and Dragon Ball Super. And as far and also non-canon material. I have not consumed all non-canon Dragon Ball material. I have consumed quite a bit of Dragon Ball material though. Some of these characters, it's been a while since I've seen. Some of these characters I have forgotten. If I've forgotten a character, they go in E tier. Anything else, I'll try to keep them in the D through SS tier, but if they're boring enough, I'll put them in E tier. Starting off, we have Android 16. We'll put him in the B tier. I'm going to have high standards right here, but I really like Android 16. But at the end of the day, he really didn't serve much of a purpose than to make Gohan turn Super Saiyan 2. That's basically it. Android 17, Super 17 I should say. He's super cool. He goes into the C tier. Android 20. Where's that Android 19? I can't remember. I think it's Android 19. And then Android 20 is Dr. Jiro. Yajirobe goes into a C tier with Android... I mean, Super 17. Uh, can't remember her, but I know she was from the Super Filler with TN's Dojo, I think it was. Krillin goes into... B tier with Android 16. 17 S tier. I really like Android 17. Aider goes into the B tier. Arali goes into D tier. Baba goes into D tier. Never really cared about her too much. Bobbity E tier just because I don't like him. Baby goes into C tier. Bardock goes into S tier with Android 17. E tier. I forgot the dog's name, but I know the purpose he serves in Z and Super. Yeah, uh, he, he was really good for Majin Buu, so C tier. Uh, Beerus, he will go C tier. I'm not going to lie, I never really care too much for Beerus. Then we have the Clown, that's A, E tier. He sucks. E tier. Bojack. Definitely going to go in the... Mm, he's an interesting villain. Pretty cool guy. And we still have a lot of tiers left. So we'll put him in the B tier. Uh, We'll put him in E tier. He sucks. Bergamo E tier. He sucks. Bola, we'll put her in the D tier. She's not too interesting. But she's Vegeta's daughter. Burly goes into the SS tier. He's epic. Uh, Bulma, we'll put her in the A tier. Kaba, we'll put him in the B tier. I, I like Kaba quite a bit. Khalifa, I don't like her too much. I forgot who she is. Cell, that's an S tier villain. Uh, Champa, never really liked Champa either. He's in the E tier though because I hate him. Forgot who that is. Chilai, best girl. We'll put her in the C tier. <laughs> Chiaotzu, he's been there since the beginning, but he's not too cool. C tier. Chilled, that goes into the D tier. I know he's Frieza's ancestor and all that, but he's really not got too much to him. Supreme Cab Time, once again, not much to her. I haven't consumed all of the Xenoverse or Heroes material, though, so... Yeah. Cooler, he's alright. C tier, not too crazy. Uh, Mask Saiyan, not really interesting. E tier. E tier. Debora, I actually think belongs in the B tier. He... He's pretty interesting. Has a nice design. Mahler, I can't remember his name. Marasaki, something like that. Dragon Ball character. D tier. Dende, D tier. Dodoria, D tier. He goes E tier. I know, actually D tier. He doesn't deserve E. Dispo, D tier. Chi Chi, I love Chi Chi. She's great. A tier with Bulma. Android 18, A tier. Actually, let's move July A tier. Uh, 
Ice Shinron, I think it was his name. We'll put him in C tier. He's interesting. Eraser. I actually like Eraser, even though she had a very small part in the show. I really liked her design. B tier, C tier, D tier. One of these three. I'll put her in D tier. That's the fairest. And I think this is supposed to be Android 21, the fighter's villain. She has a sick design. Is this supposed to be her? I uh, don't see any other pictures of her from... Actually, yeah, I see another picture of her here, actually. Uh, so I guess... I think she's got two different forms, so... Uh, I haven't consumed all of the material of her, so I'll put her in C tier there, and I'll put her in C... Actually, we'll put her in B tier, because she still has a pretty sick design. Uh... Copy Vegeta, interesting concept. I like what they did with him, but he goes in the E tier. Not too interesting as a character. Paragus, C tier? B, D tier. He's a D tier character. Fasha, E tier character. Nothing to her, really. Frieza, that is definitely a... A tier character. Sorry, Frieza's a little overrated, guys. That's just my opinion. Frost, uh, nice Frieza clone. C Zamasu was a great villain. I don't care what anyone says. B tier. Future Gohan. That's a A. Uh, my never really cared for too much. D tier. Super Future Trunks, I guess? Or is this just Future Trunks in general? Uh, for now, I'll assume it's Future Trunks in general. And I'll put him in the SS tier because he's actually my favorite character. So yeah, he goes in SS tier. Uh, I remember this guy, but he's just... A lot of the tournament of power fighters are probably going to be in E tier, if I'm being honest. Because you either forget them, or they're not interesting enough to remember. So yeah, that's basically that. Um, we'll go ahead and put Garlic Jr. in D tier. Though if I'm going to be honest, he belongs in the E. General Blue, original villain, great comedy, A tier. Don't forget General Blue, guys. He's amazing. Actually, we'll put him in B tier. <laughs> uh, Commander Rad, never really found him too interesting. Pretty flat. Dr. Dr. Giro, D tier. Gine, Gine, Goku's mom. She's great. She's a good woman. We'll put her in the A tier. Actually, we'll put her in B tier. Um... Ginyu, he goes into the C tier. Gogeta, he's alright. A tier. He's not S tier. He's not SS tier. He's he's here, though. He's here. Is that just ultimate Gohan or regular Gohan or what? Uh, well, Gohan. The, the, it's not separated into different forms. So we'll go ahead and put Gohan right into the S tier. Always really liked Gohan as a character. Goku Black. Wonderful villain. B tier with Zamasu. Since they're actually the same character, right? Right, guys? Right, guys? Okay. Goku. Then title. Well, not title character, but main character of the show. He's going in the A tier. He's not that interesting. But, he, you know, he, he's Goku. So he, you have to put him in the A tier. Goten. Goten used to be my favorite character when I was little. They haven't done much with his character in Super. He goes into the C tier. Gotenks. Same thing with Goten. Uh, Grand Priest. D tier. He was never really too interesting. I love Grandpa Gohan. He's going into the A tier. I was going to put him in the S tier. But S and SS tiers are reserved for my favorite characters, really. Uh... I remember him from GT, but I don't remember his name. So, E tier. Hit. That's a solid C character. Actually, Hit's a solid B character. Uh, e tier. Berter. D. Random Yard Rat Dude. King Piccolo. That's an A tier character. Actually, we'll put him in B tier. Because he was great, but he's not that great. Few. He has an awesome design, but I don't know too much about his character other than the Mira and Toa stuff. So, Vegeta, he's going into the SS tier. Um, Jocko the Gla I actually really like Jocko. I read the manga, so we'll put him in A tier. Is that fair though? It 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 is going to be plenty fair. 
So we'll go ahead and put him, actually we'll put him in B tier. He's more of a B tier character. Janimba, we'll go ahead and put him here. Because he has a cool design. But once again, there's not much to him. So he's going in C tier. Janim, I mean, uh, Jace, he'll go D tier, just to give him some respect. Jiren, D tier. He's, he, Kefla, I actually don't really like Kefla, if I'm being honest, but I like Kale, so we'll put her in D tier because Kale kind of redeems her for me. E tier. King Kai, we'll put him in the C tier. He's all right. He's nothing crazy. Kale, we'll put her in the A tier with with the other top. Uh, Kami, we'll put him in C tier. Like King Kai, he's all right. Uh, Corin, we'll put him in D tier. We'll put Kibido in D tier as well. Kid Buu, we'll put him in A tier. Actually. B tier. He's not too interesting. Never has been. King Cold is interesting. To an extent. C tier. Uh, King Vegeta. He's Vegeta's dad, so we'll put him in C tier to give him some respect. Actually, no. He's more of a D tier with Paragus. Forgot him. Don't care. He's alright. We'll put him in D tier. He's okay. Uh, then we have Slug. E. Yeah. E tier. Never really cared about Slug. Launch. She's okay. Dragon Ball character. Even Toriyama forgot about her. Mageta. Can't. I can't even remember if that's his name. So E tier. Mai should go with the other Mai in D tier. Actually, she's an also an OG Dragon Ball character. That's future Mai, but this Mai is OG Dragon Ball, but still D tier. Forgot who he is. Fat Boo. Love Fat Boo. He's cute. I'll put him in B tier. Actually, yeah, B tier. Sounds good. Forgot who this person is. I remember he had a cool design, though, but still forgettable. Uh, forgettable. Don't care. This is Krillin's daughter. E tier. Uh, Tian's master. I think his name was. I can't even remember. Shu? No, it's his name, not Shu. I can't even remember his name. Terrible of me to say, I know. Uh, he's an OG Dragon Ball character, that's for sure. I remember him, Tien's master. He was jerks. He was a jerk. Hated the Turtle Hermit. We'll put him in D tier, though. He deserves that, at least. Master Roshi, we will put him in C tier. Actually, he deserves to be in B tier with Kaba. Uh... He goes into D tier with all the other characters that are just okay, or I don't really like too much. Mm. I always thought he was okay. Nail is actually pretty cool, C tier. Nappa, B tier, faux show. I know he's a GT character. Nova Shinron, I really enjoyed, so we'll put him we're putting him in A tier. E tier. Elder Kai is C tier. He's appealing to me like Elder Kai is. And so Pan from GT, we'll go ahead and put her in C tier. I was considering, you know what, I'll put her in B tier. If I can put Jocko in B tier, I can put Pan in B tier. Because I really like Pan from GT. Pan from Super, she's adorable. We'll put her in B tier with Pan from GT. Boma's mom's alright, D tier. Forgot who this guy was. Piccolo goes into the... 
A tier or S tier? Uh, A tier. Sorry guys, I like Piccolo a lot, but he's not S tier material. And here you go in C tier, just because of his role in the show. E tier. Perunga, E tier, he's just there. E tier. Raditz, I always thought Raditz was pretty dope. I think he belongs right up there with Nappa in the B tier. Goes into the E tier. Raccoon. C tier. I think he's the highest one out of the Guinea Force I've placed. Uh, Rebrian, E tier. I hate Rebrian. E, 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 E. I really enjoy Hercule. I'm not going to lie. He's great. A tier with Piccolo. Uh, actually, no. We'll put him in B tier. That's a bit more fair. Uh, Shinron. D tier, because he's more relevant than Purunga. I I can't even remember this guy's name. So, E tier. E tier. Shu, we'll put him in D tier with my E tier. Eh, uh, he was just there. E tier. E tier. Spopovich is a D tier character. He, he served a pretty decent purpose. No, actually he didn't. E tier. <laughs> original Broly. Nobody's denying that original Broly was cool. A? I mean, B? C? He's a C tier character. Uh... Forgettable. I can't remember her. I know she's from Dragon Ball though. D tier. Actually, we'll put Supreme Kai in C tier. I liked his design, not gonna lie, so we'll put him in C tier. That's Ginyu Tagama, right? Is that Ginyu Tagama? Or is that just Tagama? We'll put him in. Wait, have we had Captain Ginyu? Have we had a Captain Ginyu? I don't think we have. I think this is supposed to be... No, wait. Captain Ginyu's right there. Uh, yeah, I think this is just Tagama. So we'll keep him in D, because I like his design. You can't forget Mercenary Tao. He's going in the C tier. I always thought he was funny. I really like him. Uh, T, T, T. I'm, I'm, I'm forgetting his name, even though I really like him. A tier. He's dope. Pretty cool guy. And a lot of people do not give this man Tarbo the respect he deserves. So I'm putting him in the B tier to show him the respect he deserves. Vegeta's little brother? Nobody respects him. B tier. TN. I actually really like TN as well. He deserves to be in the same tier as Jocko the Galactic Patrolman. Bulma's sister. I read some of Jocko the Galactic Patrolman. She goes into the C tier, if I'm being honest. Uh... Mustachio goes into C tier. X, yeah, he goes into C tier. No, he goes into D tier. Uh, he goes into the E tier. I don't care. Kid Trunks goes into the C tier. Did I put? Yeah. With Goten and Go Tanks. Terrius. D tier. Terrius is all right, but he's he's not that great. Uh, Turtle. You can't disrespect Turtle, but at the same time, you can. D tier. Oob. I like Oob. GT. Z. Some of Super Material. We'll put him in C tier. He's alright. I like him as much as I like Broly. Z Broly, I mean. Uh. Bottles is a D tier. Vegito. We'll put him in the A tier. Uh, Videl. Definitely going in the S tier. Whis. I actually really enjoy Whis, so we'll put him in A tier. Uh, C tier. No, D tier. Yamcha has been there since the very beginning. We'll put him in B tier with Tien. He deserves that. Zamasu, we'll put him in the B tier right here. 
I'm going to revise some of this later after I finish it to make it more accurate. Okay, so I guess Ultimate Gohan and Teen Gohan are different characters now, but we'll put them both in S tier. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Zarbon. I always liked his design, so C tier. Uh, forgettable. Zenos. Uh, actually, Thanos. Thanos. We'll put him in E. And then Zeno. There's not much to say about him. D tier. Okay, so let's revise some of this. Make sure everybody is where they should be. If I need to make any alterations, I will. So these are actually my top three favorite characters, I think, if I'm being honest. So Videl is S tier waifu. Future, I mean not future Gohan, Teen Gohan. Ultimate Gohan, yes, makes sense, makes sense. Okay, everything's looking good. These are definitely A tiers. Yes, A tier characters. A tier, A tier, A tier. B tier. Uh, we'll put Curlin in A tier. Uh, let's see, the war B tier. 21, yes, 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 yes. I actually really liked the Zamasu stuff, so we'll, we'll change them from B tier to A tier. Uh, General Blue remains in B tier. Gine Hit is B tier. Jocko is B tier, yes. Kid Boo. Okay, everything's looking fair enough there. And yeah, I think I think the rest of this is pretty pretty solid. Uh, I want to give Ginyu more credit though. Put him in B tier because he was one of the great villains. Interesting. Um, Super 17, I actually want to put higher on the list, but he's GT, so we'll keep him at C. I would, if he was not in GT, we would, we would put him in B. Um, Oob deserves more respect, I gotta tell you, so we'll put him in B tier. Uh, other than that, I think everybody is right where they should actually... I watched GT when I was little, and Omega Shinron was crazy, son, but he is not B tier material, he's C tier. Uh, my E tier is crazy, but I think every person here belongs in the E tier. Uh, in fact, he belongs in the E tier. And I guess that's as accurate as I can be to my own opinion. Once again, this is all just my opinion. Personal opinions, my opinion. Paragus, we'll put him in C tier because he was pretty interesting in the Burly movie. Uh, and we will go ahead and... I guess everything looks good. Everything is looking pretty good, pretty good, if I do say so myself. These are like my top three favorite characters, and then here's my other characters that are my favorite. I love Cell. Cell is amazing. Uh, and then Frieza, A tier. Boo. All right, so that's why I have... Wait, I just realized there's no Super Boo. There's only Kid Boo and Fat Boo. Okay, so I think this tier list is just about set. I'm looking through and seeing if there's anything else I'm missing, but everything, everybody I feel is right where they should be. In my own, once again, my own personal opinion. Cannot stress that enough. Um, I'm just looking, and I'm just looking to make sure there's sh the list should be modified or not. And I think it's fine. I I I believe I believe so. I believe it is fine. There's really not many Dragon Ball characters I can say I hate. In fact, I would say the only Dragon Ball characters I really don't like are the E-tier characters, where I've either forgotten them or I just don't like them. Uh, so yeah, these are all the characters I forgot or don't like, or I feel don't serve a purpose. D-tier characters, I'm pretty indifferent toward. I'm like, 
yeah, they exist. You know, like, yeah, they're there. Yeah, I feel that way about Kefla, if I'm being honest. She's there. Uh, King Vegeta, he's there. C-tier characters are characters that I find mildly interesting. Or they have a good effect on me. So, that is, of course, Zarbon. Mildly interesting. Janimba, interesting design. Bulma's sister, interesting, interesting. Everybody here is interesting. And then, these are characters that are pretty interesting. But, uh, are still, at the end of the day, just pretty interesting. So, that's why you have Kaba here and everything like that. Actually, yeah. Yeah, that looks good, actually. A tier are reserved for the good characters. And I mean the great characters. Characters that you cannot get over. Characters that are awesome. And I think Grandpa Gohan is awesome. Future Gohan is awesome. Then you go into C tier. My top 5 through 10. And then S tier. My top 1 through 5. S tier. Is the GOAT. But yeah guys. I guess we'll go ahead and end this video here. We basically have the video to an end. I've done everything I really needed to do. Even though there's not five characters in the SS tier, I think this is good to have only three characters in the SS tier. But yeah, guys. Actually, we'll put Super Broly in the S tier. I think right now, where Super Broly just came out, Super Broly still has a very positive effect on me, but at the end of the day, it's probably just a honeymoon phase, so we'll put him in with Android 17, who I still like, Bardock, who I still like, So who I still like, Gohan, who I still like, and Videl, who is the GOAT. We'll call that the end of the video, guys. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you have some mistake, comment down below. If you feel like, subscribe, because as always, guys, please feel free to subscribe to Red Eye.